What else would you like to report yeah, on from Italy? Any news from our, our comrades in Sicily? I know uh, the elections oh, yeah, are over. You know, the election. There are elections down there now, and uh, you know this uh, this upcoming Sunday, actually, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, and uh, so after that, you know, the skies will be will be clear. But uh, what I want to tell you guys is that you know, uh, as the as the summer approaches, uh, during the summer and right after the summer, we are looking we're looking forward to you know expand our efforts. And what we just mentioned, the remittance campaign, as we discussed before is something that we really want to work heavily in Italy as well, because uh, I think that it's something that could really be the, the international campaign, an international campaign that every chapter should, uh, you know, if they're interested in doing, should uh, should follow. So that's Excellent. something that we're really excited for most of September. David, I, I know there's a lot of people who would like to ask more questions, but I saw you were on when I couldn't get Nairobi and I knew you had people coming in, so I jumped you ahead of Nairobi. I just saw that they came online, so uh, we want to give you a big thank you for all your work in Italy. Okay, do not leave. I am the one to thank you. We are the one to thank you all. We really are. <laughs> okay, and uh, David's on Facebook, and uh, he keeps waiting for all of y'all to friend him. He's one of our more active Acorn International Facebookers. What's his last name? T O Z Z O David Tasso. Tasso. Okay. Okay. Help me. Help me. I don't know okay. Who it's help me, everybody. Thank you so much. Muchísimas gracias y buen trabajo. Okay. Okay. Thank you, David. Okay. I saw. I saw the Sammy come online, dude. Sammer. On a roll. Yeah. I, we're having this could be our record performance. Four or four. <laughs> yeah, okay. Don't it's be holding your breath if on that one. Okay, they'll be looking for Hootie. Mexico City. David is with you? Yes, he's just about to arrive. He had an activity in the field. Repeat that. Just two minutes, he's coming. Okay, he'll be here soon? Yes, he's just arriving in the next two minutes. Okay, do you want to go ahead and start uh, talking without him? Because uh, we, we have a lot of people in, in the queue today. and. I'm so glad to get you. I was afraid the internet wasn't working in Nairobi. Why don't you start uh, telling how the internet is going? Uh, we are doing very well here in Korovosho. In fact, we are just talking from inside our office at Kalimbani. We're all listening. Go ahead. Why don't you tell people about the educational uh, campaign? At the education campaign, uh, uh, we've taken a new turn. Initially, we were looking at the transition from secondary, from primary to secondary. But we, we realized that the, the, the bigger gap is the lower level. That is, those who are not going to school and uh, at their early age. Can you hear me still? We can hear you. Yeah. Oh. I turned on the video so we could get a better connection. Okay. I, I, I just got worried what is happening because I saw you disappeared all of a sudden. No, keep going. I'll let you know if we lose you. <laughs> so, so, so basically now we are focusing on uh, trying to mobilize those children who are not going to school and yet they are they have reached the age of going to school in Colorado. In fact, there are so many, so many who are just idling around. And most of the parents even don't care whether they go or they don't. One thing that, one of the aspects that they, they look at is uh, that they, they use these children actually as a way to bring something to eat the whole of the day. Some of the parents send their, their children to the dark 
Dusty. You remember Professor Alan uh, Pinham. So most of uh, the students do uh, cabbage media so that an arm can be done on the field. And together as a company together so that they can have something to eat. But we we are we have a very good link with the area shield. And uh, we are trying to play this should be so far we've been able to take back more than 40 children who are not going to school and they are now in school. In fact, uh, seven of them are at uh, the primary, uh, 20, 20 are in uh, one of the, the schools supported by the Catholic Church of St. Kandibangi, and uh, three are within another school supported by another church with promotion. Sammy, why don't, you, why don't you tell people what happened at your big rally with the puppets? Ah! <laughs> Hello, can you hear me? Yes, yes we can hear you great. Hello. How are you going, brother? Yeah, so, so we, we had a night a big campaign on issues of education in Korogosho. And uh, this was uh, last month. And we had solicited support from so many organizations working in Korogosho. So many people had turned up. And we had set ourselves for a campaign. In fact, one of the organizations that had supported the, 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 the initiative was the Jones Catholic Church. There was also the Equity Bank had also uh, supported in making the banner for us. Then we had also the big package which we focused with the mobilization. And uh, uh, actually, uh, we had done all the preparations and we started the, 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 the whole process because we had to start with the process and end with a kind of discussion. But along the way, we had an interaction. There was chaos erupted all of a sudden, and uh, the whole process, procession was disrupted. And uh, we had to, 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 to take quick, to quick decisions so that actually our people and you know, also the children who are in the procession do not be acted. Because there was uh, even the fire, fire uh, FCD fire. Because the police uh, were called, the reinforcement of the police was called to, to, to come down the, the crowd. Literally, the, the, the main problem was there was a person who had been uh, uh, actually, one of his motorbikes was stolen. And then it reported the person who had the motorbike. And so, this is what we know that we think we have to revenge. Sammy? And that's why we are crying for the, the blood of us who actually wanted to kill him. Yes? Hello? Sammy, just a second. I might Sammy, Sammy, hold on. I'm going to uh, repeat some of what you just said. Hold on just a minute. So they had a big rally. They had these giant puppets that were five and six feet tall and hundreds of people had come together basically on this campaign for more schools. They wanted to build more elementary schools. Unfortunately, while they were rallying in front of the chief's compound, a group of young youngster, young men, teenagers, had captured a guy who had stolen somebody's motorbike and hurt that person. So they a gang of them, about a hundred of the young ruffians, as, uh, as Sammy calls them, pulled him into the chief's compound and were beating him to death. What this meant is that all of a sudden the police had to be mobilized with the troops to come and stop this vigilante action on the motor scooters thieves because thieves, they were killing the guy. So they had to take him. Well, what this meant is that we had this big march and rally that all of a sudden ran into this vigilante riot. So Sammy and David had to exercise some professional judgment and postpone our rally until it was safe <laughs> for another day. Okay, Sammy, I just uh, gave up a brief summary of what you just said. Uh, go forward now. Thank you for that. 
<laughs> After that, we, 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 we called a, a committee after one week to, to, to bring the way forward. And uh, this is the time we, we decided that we will have to focus not in the procession, not in that big campaign, but village to village, door to door, trying to look for the children who are not going to school. And this is what we have been focusing on for the last uh, one month. And this has, what has resulted to so many children getting back to school. When does school start? Um, so you'd be running this campaign over the summer, or, or how do you see it? Uh, actually, what, we, what we've been doing, we've been having a good link with the schools. And so every time that we got an opportunity, uh, to, to, to take the child to the school, and the school accepts for the whole that child. We just continue, despite, because the schools were opened actually in January, but along the, the middle we have been also accepting to accommodate these children who have not been going to school. Excellent. One of the questions that the organizers always are asking people on Skype is, how is our membership doing? How many members do we have now in Korogocho? Uh, actually, we, we have um, our two major areas that is uh, high reach. High reach, we have uh, for, 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 for 400 members within that area. Then in Kisimudoha, we have around 250. But we are also happy now quite a number of people coming from other villages because we have opened it up. Uh, but one of the biggest challenges that we are, we are facing, as we have indicated in the report, is the uh, majority of the people are willing and they are joining, but they are reluctant in their making their monthly contribution. Fantastic. I'm going to have Judy sit here for a second so she can say hello and ask a question. Okay. Her pockets are feeling light. <laughs> Shallow. Shallow. Hello. I'm still on. Hey, Sammy. Hi, Judy. How are you? I can't see you. I can't see you. I'm fine. How's David? Is he there yet? Sorry? Where's David? David had an activity and he was joining me immediately. I, I think he's just some few minutes away from me. Well, say hi to him for me. Yeah, I'll do that. So, so, okay, well, I have, I have two questions. One, what were the giant puppets of? Pardon? What were the puppets of? The politicians? What were the puppets? The puppets. Yeah, what were they of? What did they represent? What did they represent? Uh, we, 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 we have just hired from the, within the area of Kalimbangi. So, so these are the people who actually uh, they, they, they act on behalf of the any group who wish to use them for the mobilization. So we, we had hired them on that particular day. Ah, uh, uh, okay, cool. And uh, it, that's too bad about the riot, but that sounds like you guys had great turnout for the rally. Yes, we can get them. Yeah, we still have our issue. We still communicate with them. Yeah. And so are you guys, are, did you plan a, another rally? Hello? Did you plan another rally? Sammy, she's asking uh, if you have plans for another rally. We've not been able to plan another rally. What we've been doing is, hello, we've not, we've not been able to plan another rally. What we've been doing is, uh, uh, we've been having uh, uh, columns, smaller columns within Korogosho villages. So in every village we are having smaller columns with groups within that particular area. So we move from one area, for example, Kis Korogosho A to Korogosho B to Hyrich to Kisimuroho and so and so on. So this week we go in one of the villages, then another week we plan we go in another village and we mobilize the people and we discuss issues related to education and it's important. Okay. Oh, that sounds cool. Um, Wade's Great. just going to activate the picture.
Hello? Sammy, everybody, everybody wants to uh, wave <coughs> goodbye to you, so I put the picture on. Can you see us? Yes, I can see you now. Okay, hey, hey Sammy, hey, thank you. Sammy. Hey. Good luck. Thank you, Bye, uh, thanks for the report, Sammy. Thank you, have a good time. Okay, okay. tell David, I'll, we'll talk again soon uh, back in the States. Uh, we have another report coming in from Delhi in a minute, so we're going to ring off and good luck in Korogochu. Thank you. When are you coming to Kenya? Ah, we'll talk about that. <laughs> I, I hope this year, but we'll have to see how the money goes. Okay, hey, good you. luck. Uh, bye. 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 Bye.